All right, I'm here with Coach Rice, St. Paris Graham High School. And, um, Coach, national rankings aside, you've had a great tournament. Obviously, you come in uh, top 35 in the nation, but you're going to probably finish. It looks like the team score is putting you right around five. Uh, can you talk about, was that a chip on your shoulder, or was that just, hey, that's the way things go, we got to wrestle? How, does that, how do you talk to the team about that kind of stuff? Yeah, I think some of it, um, right, we had we had a tough senior class last year. We lost uh, some some big guys, so so I think some of that we you lose a couple guys like that. It's tough to it's tough to replace those guys. Um, and then we got a really young team, so you know, so some of that coming in, we're a little down, a little young, but I got a lot of young guys that like to fight. They just yeah. like to go hard and they like to scrap. So you know, you kind of. You know, hey, it is what it is. There's a lot of really good teams, so it's always hard to pick and choose who's where. And it's like, you know, hey, that's that's okay. Um, you know, I, I think I think we had a really good weekend this weekend so far. Um, <laughs> that's an understatement, coach, but that's all right. <laughs> it's something to keep keep building off of. Um, yeah. So yeah, we, we'll talk with the guys. You know, hey, we. You mentioned right. having a young team, and you just mentioned a little while ago how many freshmen, sophomores, basically underclassmen you have. Is that a testament to the Graham culture? Is that a testament to these kids? Is that a testament to your coaching abilities? What is this? We have big shoes to fill, obviously, and Coach Mack and, and Coach Jordan, but you're obviously filling them. Those kids are dynamic. They just, you got one in the finals here. You got still some guys left trying to get top five, top three. Um, what do we, what, I mean, what's going on out there in Graham? What are you drinking out there? What kind of water you got in there? Uh, no, I think it, it, you know, it all started with Coach McCunn way back when he was there and he started everything. Mm. Um, and then Coach Jordan and, and then what he ha has built here at Graham and just, just the testament to him and those guys, the, the hard work, the, the work ethic, the dedication, discipline. Um, and then Coach Mack stepping in and following, following up with it. And, and then now, now with me, just trying to keep building off of it, right? Doing, getting these guys doing the right things. Um, working hard and just being disciplined and, and good kids. Really Aside from that, man, they really seem to enjoy and be extremely grateful for the opportunity to put on the Graham singlet. Like some kids, sometimes they have an air of, I don't know what the right word, I don't want to say arrogance, but your kids are humble and I appreciate um, like talking to them and getting to watch them wrestle. Like they never throw headgear. They never do any of those things. I'm not trying to jinx you guys, but for North, is that something you guys talk about or is that just who they are? Yeah, I think it's something with the with the program, you know, all the great programs have, have things like that as well. You know, there's a there's a set standard that you you hold yourself to and hold yourself accountable to. And uh, I, I think that's something we take pride in at Graham is is being not just good wrestlers, but good good men and good you know good kids on and off the mat. Whether it's school, whether it's in the hallway, whether it's you know in the in the stands, whatever it is, um, just making sure these guys are doing the right things and uh, and just being good good kids. And, and and I think that's just a testament to the guys in the program that you know Coach Jordan and Coach McCon started that. And it's every year that's kind of just been the expectation, and we try to try to keep it going and just make sure we're carrying on with that and representing the school. In that's that way. amazing. Where do you guys? go from here uh next week we're going out to crown point uh, okay. in indiana so all right it'll be, it'll be a good tournament they got a really tough team um there's a couple other really good teams that are there and i think there's like 16 or 20 teams something like that will be there so it'll be a, it'll be another another really tough weekend for these guys so well be hey good. best of luck in the concept semis best of luck in the finals best of luck next week coach yes sir have a good one man thank you